Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Sunday the 22nd of September. I almost launched into October there for a second. It's still 2024 and it's still September, although September is a ticking away. Um, what's going on in the world? Some good news. Uh, Elon Musk has decided to comply with Brazil to put X, the X Twitter uh, back onto into Brazil. Um, that mean that means he had to appoint a legal representative in Brazil, pay the outstanding fines, and um, oh yeah, take down those sites that were spreading lies and disinformation and causing harm to the population of Brazil that were ordered taken down by the courts some time ago. So isn't that great news? other countries please take note what you can do see you ban the man and he'll cower he'll he'll bend his he'll bend <laughs> he'll buckle to your will if you are a government just because he's the world's richest um entity seemingly uh, you know wandering around by himself doing you know um great harm to the planet um as well as some good in places um you know, you have to not be afraid of these kind of people. He really only cares about money anyway. So, you know, if you start attacking his money supply, well, that's going to affect him, isn't it? Right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku. Anyway, so good news. Seven. This is the Observer Sudoku. What level is it? I have no idea because the Sudoku uh, in the Observer is never rated. And so I can't really say... Uh, what to expect although even with sudokus where we are given ratings sometimes we don't know what to expect so stick with it and we'll find out how easy or difficult it turns out to be uh, quite soon I guess what's missing in those squares there uh, three and two hmm. have one across here and one up there so one into one of those two squares blocking back in this direction and a one blocking up there gives me a one in that square Let's uh, take things bit by bit and see where it leads us. I'm very distracted at the moment. I can hear a strange crackling sound. I'm suspecting there's a cockroach or something in the house, in this room. I'm become highly suspicious. I can hear that kind of sound. Sometimes they get into, like, uh, if there's a cockroach which has come out to eat the cat food, they get into a box or something like that and can't get out, and you hear them scurrying, scurrying, I should say. And uh, it's a, always a, a horrid thing. I dislike cockroaches, I must say. They are not my friends. We have no digit three. There is no digit three. Okay, so this game is definitely going to take a bit of thought. Six is already looked at. Seven, on the other hand, will do nicely here and across here. Eight blocking down there. A 
this way and down there. Uh, so we've got eight blocking this square, eight blocking this square, eight blocking this square, eight blocking this square, and eight blocking this square in this column. Enough room to, for an eight in that location only. Missing numbers here and here are three and five. I'm still hearing that horrible sound. I'm hoping I'm not going to have to pause the game and go cockroach, cockroach hunting. It's one of the disadvantages of living in a hot country. Um, and uh, living not in a condo... Well, actually, they still sometimes appear in par apartments and condominiums, I've noticed. Um, occasionally, you do get them. They're not, you're not, they're not immune. I don't know if they go up in the lift or the elevator, as Americans call it, but um, I don't really know how they get to such heights, but they sometimes do. Let's see if we ought to go around once more. Uh, that's it. I think I'm out now. Yep. That just following around like that is not going to get me any further. It's time to look for something else. Oh, it's going to wake me up on a Sunday morning. I haven't had breakfast, but I'm not very hungry. It's quite late in the morning, really. I slept and woke up early and then went back to sleep again, which is kind of unusual, but uh, I've had a, a super long rest. Just uh, exploring, just looking up and down the columns to see. Uh, uh, let's look at the row as well. Any ones that don't have, the only ones that have, say, four empty squares is what I'm trying to look at. very far.
Um, not seeing very much. Uh, but there are quite a few pairs around. And so I should probably put them in in pencil marks. Ah, we've got one and seven across here, and we've got one and seven across there, and we've got one and seven down there. Mm -hmm. So we've got a pair of one and seven in those squares there. So these are not one or seven, they have to be three, of course, because we haven't got any threes. Three, five, one, three, five. So, uh, huh? No, that's not right. Three, this is what, um, one and seven are there, so we're looking for three, five, and six. Sorry, three, five, and six. Hmm. Huh. So that means that's a three or a five. Sixes are there. Nothing new then. Uh, one seven. Let's just have a look. See if there's anything else along here. One and seven. What else do we see? A pair of fives there. Twos we already know are there. much help on the fours nines possible in three squares a yuck I wonder if this block holds the key though. I can't quite see it, but let's uh, put in the pencil marks in, in this block here. Let's see what it leads to, shall we? I've got twos and those squares. And I've got uh, nine and four blocking across there, right? So, and nine blocking up there. So we get nines in those squares. Uh, I have five blocking down here, so we get five like this down here threes of course can go anywhere Um, so I haven't put in any threes. Of course, we've got threes everywhere here. So there aren't any singles there. Three, five there, three, four there. All right, let's just do a bit more in the middle. Uh, I don't know anything about threes again. Four blocks up here like this and across there. But there's a pair of fours. Five blocks across here like this. Ah, this could be a single three. One, two, three is anywhere. Four, five, six, seven, eight. We've got nine blocking up here and nine across there. Oh, we had a pair of nine and four there. Oh, I got you now. Okay. So that's a pair of four and nine. This five is actually not true. Uh, this five is not going to be true. So I know we've got three in, in both of these two squares then. So here's our three. There's our three. And now I'm going to have a four in this square. And so nine here and four there. And let's get rid of all of these candidate fours that we can't use. Two, nine, five, okay. And nine blocks across here. So no nines available there. That's our nine, that's our five, and that's our two. Two is needed up here, three is needed there. Okay, so that's a bit better now, isn't it? A bit handier. Let's 
let's see if we've got anything else. So actually probably not much has changed because all of that was concerning the middle row, wasn't it? So um Okay, let's uh, see what we've got up here. Uh, we're looking for three, four, and five in those squares there. So let's put in the threes and the fours, and let's put the fives there. Oh, I've just remembered this was f one of these missing numbers was a five, wasn't it? So that can't be a five. That's our five, that's our six, in fact. And so six blocking up here and up here, oops, and six across there will give me a six in that square. The last number to place here is seven, and now we've got seven across here and seven across there and seven up there. So there's a seven, there's a one, there's a seven. Now our ones blocking down like this gives us one in that square, one across here, across there, and down there, there's a one, and one to the top, and across there. six blocking down here and down there so there's a six six across here and down to the bottom and down there and across there there's another six and there's only one digit missing here which is our three which was our non-starter Um, what's left? Eight blocks across there it gives us an eight in that square and huh, sorry, wrong mode selected again. Eight goes there somehow or another. I think I hit the wrong key on the keyboard and sometimes changes the mode automatically without me knowing. Nine blocks up there, there's the nine. This will be a four. Four blocks down there here, there's our four. The last two numbers to get here are three and five. This is a three and five as well, isn't it? So it means that these two squares can't be three or five. They have to be two. So two down there. There's our two. And they ha the other has to be six. No, not six. The other has to be... Not three or five, four. Four blocks up here and up here. And there's our four, so now we know that's a five. And we can get rid of our candidate five there. Uh, what's left? What's left? What's left? What's missing from here? Um, 
two. Okay, so we've got two blocking here, so that will be two in that row. Sorry, two here, and this will be uh, a nine. And we still need a nine at the end of this row. And nine blocking down here and across there says so that's a nine. And three, four, five blocks this square here. So in this column, here's our five. That's our three. That's our three, that's our three, that's our five, that's our five. And we also have five blocking across here, giving us five in that square to finish the fives. We still need a three here and a four there. And the missing digits up here are two blocking up there. So there's our two and a three finishes the game. So rather a good puzzle there, I think, from the observer. Never quite sure what level it is even after I've finished I'm not sure what quite le I'm not quite sure what level it was there was a pair there that I could have found uh, in the middle there but I didn't spot but you know I'm lazy it's easy to play the game with pencil marks and I get you to the end that's it take care bye bye